Hello guys and welcome to Cossacks 3. This is the Battle of Falkirk Muir. Let's begin. Um, guys, uh, I'm playing this mission on normal difficulty. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit the like button and the subscribe button. If you plan on buying Cossacks 3 or any other games, you can get them really cheap um, from G2A.com. They're my official sponsor. If you plan to buy anything, the, G the link is in the description. You can use the SHD code to get 2% cash back. Unencumbered by artillery, your troops managed to approach the British positions quickly and discreetly. The British did not expect your appearance at all, so their camp is in disarray and fuss. You have very little time before they finally recover from the surprise and form up the battle attack quickly. But do not lose your head, even a confused Englishman will not be easy prey. We will tear them to shreds, shreds as the wind tears the clouds. Okay, to win, defeat the British army. You lose if you lose all your soldiers. Horses, horses, guys. The Saxon cavalry went to the back to the attack. Denzel rose. See yourself if you do not want to become a food for crows and foxes. Draw the swords. Let them. Let's make sausages from the British and their horses. For King James. Okay. I should have not. Saxons, where are you going? We have not finished yet. Guys, go ahead. Do not let them go. Do not let them come to their senses. Unleash your swords. Water them with the British blood. Kill without mercy. They cannot escape from us. Even if they grow wings. Stand, hold the line. Someone said. Mac McDonald's, drunk with the British blood and inspired by fleeing English soldiers, started to pers pursue the retreating cavalry. Inspired by their example, the passionate Highlanders from the other clans also rushed forward. It was impossible to restore the order and the entire right flank of your army rushed into the attack. Damn them all, let the center and the left flank also attack. Okay, let's attack. Which I think is a very bad attack, the way I do it. <coughs> For the king anyway. For the king. You should go on this side here. Yeah? If they are in stand ground, you can stand ground. Why are the Saxons hesitating? No more power to flee? Look, the lines, uh, they line up for battle. The Saxon dragoons again line up to attack. The gales stand, line up, all to me, Piper, start playing louder, blow with all your might. Quickly, send someone with the order for reserve to attack. These are the reserves. Cavalry is coming. The riders. It's gonna take time until uh, these guys will arrive. You have gained a new victory, but the British are like a hydra. You cut one head, then two new ones immediately grow. The Duke of Cumberland, son of George II, came from the south. Brave Blakeney did not surrender Sterling, even after Howley's defeat at Falkirk. The troops are hungry and bloodless, and the army of the Duke of Cumberland easily receives the best supplies possible and does not suffer from anything lacking. 
you had no choice but to withdraw your troops to the north. The Duke of Cumberland followed along the coast after you. You failed to break away from him and there is no hope to increase the forces. You have to dare to fight one more battle. Well, we'll meet the Saxon at Cullendon. It's victory, guys. Winter. Winter looks better now. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and also check out my official sponsor G2A.com. If you plan to buy anything from them, use the SHD code to get 3% cash back. Take care of you now. Bye bye.